Online exchanges are where most people buy and sell their cryptocurrency. On an exchange, you can create an account, transfer your money from your bank account, and convert it into cryptocurrency. You can even buy crypto using your debit or credit card. Crypto exchanges charge a small fee per transaction, which varies depending on the exchange you're using and the currency that you are buying. You can think of exchanges like digital banks, but unlike a bank, if you lose access to the exchange, you lose your cryptocurrency. So you better keep that password in a safe place. So what exchanges are there? There are multiple exchanges available for you to use. Coinbase and Binance are probably the most popular. Coinbase is great because they make it very simple to buy, sell or convert cryptocurrency right from the app on your phone. It's perfect for beginners or casual crypto users. Binance is a little bit more involved than Coinbase because as well as buying crypto with your bank account or credit card, you can also do a lot of other things. You get full access to price charts, spot and margin trading, futures, and staking services, and we'll cover all those features in more detail in a future video. Here at Upstream, we have found it is best to have accounts with multiple exchanges. The main reason being that not all exchanges have every coin on the market available to buy or trade. Having access to multiple exchanges gives you a wider scope for your crypto investment and more options to move your crypto around if you need to. Exchanges are a great place to buy and trade with your cryptocurrency. But if you plan on hodling or keeping your crypto for a long time, we recommend moving it to a secure wallet. Leaving crypto on the exchange comes with risk because you do not own the private keys. There is a saying in crypto, not your keys, not your crypto. Which means if you don't have the keys, your investment is at risk because you won't be able to withdraw your funds if the exchange is hacked or goes offline. With ownership in mind, the main thing to look for when selecting a crypto wallet is private key ownership. Owning the private key to your crypto wallet means that you and only you have full responsibility for and control over your cryptocurrency investment. Don't worry, it's not as scary as it sounds. Trusting yourself with ultimate responsibility and the rewards that come with that can be an amazing experience. The Yori wallet is a fantastic example of a wallet where you are the true custodian of your cryptocurrency. When you set up the wallet, you are given a 12 word passphrase that needs to be entered in order to set up or recover your wallet. These phrases in the particular order that they were given are your private key. We can't stress how vital it is to keep your physical copies of these in an extremely secure place, like a fireproof safe. By owning a private key, you are in control of your crypto and can access it at any time. There are some great wallets out there, but whatever you do, make sure you are in control of your investment by selecting a wallet where you hold the private key. A simple Google search will be able to tell you this. There are some disadvantages of wallets too though. For example, you can't sell or convert your crypto from most wallets. You'll need to move your coins back onto an exchange before you can do that, and this can incur a transfer or network fee. If you're hodling and believe in the long-term value of a project, you may not worry too much about the uh, short-term price fluctuations. But if the market crashes and you need to sell quickly, having your crypto in a wallet adds an extra step to that process. Generally, when the market crashes, the waves of panic inevitably come and many people flock to exchanges to sell their crypto. This leads to increased traffic, which can cause the exchanges to crash. This sometimes means you need to wait longer to cash out. This is where a strong strategic buyout plan comes into play. You will need one of these to realize profit and maximize your investment, but we'll get into that in a future video. So in summary, you're gonna come across and use both crypto exchanges and crypto wallets somewhere along your cryptocurrency journey. An exchange is a great tool for buying and trading crypto. A wallet is a secure place to store your crypto safely for longer periods of time. To learn more about staking your ADA with Upstream, check out our website or follow us on Twitter at Upstream underscore ADA.